Kesha. With Kesha, which was always tough because the music industry is even worse. You know this. I mean, the music industry has to be one of the most misogynistic uh, industries there are. And the people who I knew about who were coming forward were not of A-level status who had encountered right. this guy. But Kelly but now, Clarkson. Kelly Clarkson. And then Gaga well, has Kelly, been unrelenting. Kelly Clarkson basically said... Uh, they wanted me to work with him. I didn't. I like working with everyone. I had to work with him. I didn't like him. She was sorry, saying he was a bad guy, and that she was blackmailed into working with him, uh, uh, which is, which is exactly. It's amazing. It's uh, she's echoing exactly what I've been arguing in the paperwork for the injunction. So that's helpful. Gaga's helpful. The the Taylor Swift is helpful because all of these are people who have worked with this guy, understand it, and boy, when he the only person who's come out and supported him besides his uh, lawyer is his mom and his sister. Now, that's a small crowd, and that's not exactly um, a resounding chorus of support. Do you, is there a possibility, and does it work this way, where it gets to a point where Kelly Clarkson is subpoenaed and has to take the stand? Yeah, that's absolutely possible. Will we see. ever yeah. get that far down the road we'll see we'll know i'll tell you next week we'll know a lot more by next week but when kelly clarkson you know when you turn on tmz and kelly clarkson is you know they're playing an interview of hers that she did on a radio show, show saying right. she didn't like this guy she didn't trust this guy she was blackmailed and working with this guy he wasn't a good guy which you can read between a few different ways you know? um that as as an attorney that's good news yeah that's uh, that's